in today's video, I'm just going to be showing you guys my games from number one in the world. Hope you guys enjoy the video. Yo, what's up guys? In today's video, I'm going to be going for top one with my new log bait deck. If you guys enjoy the video, please make sure to like and subscribe. I'm just going to go for my Ice Spear at the bridge here, and I will go for my Princess in the back. He goes for his Mighty Miner in the back, so I'll go for my, mm, I'll go for my Mighty Miner in the back because he's sparkied. No point to split my goblins just for him to use the ability. I'll split my goblins now, just to make sure that the Mighty Miner dies. He pops the ability. My goblins will take care of the Mighty Miner, but Princess does die first for whatever reason. I'll just go for my cannon in the middle. I know he's going to kite that over with the giant, because I know he's playing giant Sparky. He sparkied the bat, because everybody knows I'm using lightning at this point. Should be an easy defense if I play well, though. I'll go for Ice Spirit on Dominions. I'll go for Princess down here. <laughs> he tried to predict me. I'll just goblins here on top of the Sparky, and then I'll go for my Mighty Miner as well. Make sure that the Sparky doesn't get any damage on my tower, and make sure that my Mighty Miner stays alive. I'll go for my Barrel here with the Mighty Miner. Doesn't have anything good for this, because he has to Zappies for the Mighty Miner too. Okay, my, my Mighty Miner's on tower. I'm going to log the Zappies and pop the ability. Okay, Princess didn't splash all of them, unfortunately, but that's still a ton of damage. I'll Ice Spirit and Goblins here to keep my Princess alive. Look at all that damage. 2,700 on the right, and... 2800 on the left <laughs> oh princess shot that's two princess shots i'll go for my cannon here in the middle just to finish off the mighty miner this is looking really good for me this guy went way too aggressive with that push he just tried to get me right off the start with the sparky in the back knowing that i have lightning this is fine though i'm just gonna wait play it a bit passive and see what he wants to do He's probably gonna set up another sparky in the back trying to win he goes for sparky in the back i'll just go for my barrel here force him to use his arrows hopefully he, he goes for the minions. I'll just go for my princess in the back. He's going to try to go like giant zappies at the bridge on the left, I think. Oh, mighty miner in the back. Just for the three card cycle. I know my mighty miner is not going to kill the giant. Oh, cannon as well. He goes for mighty miner at the bridge. I'll go for my goblins here. Just pull it into the middle. Also help kill the giant. I'll go for lightning on all three of these. Very nice value lightning there. And now I'm just going to... I don't even need to pop the ability. The, his, the, the goblins got the sparky. Okay. I'm just going to pop the ability here, try to hit the zappies and get some tower damage. Okay, I hit one of the zappies. I'll barrel with this as well. Make sure to finish off the tower or force out the arrows. I'll princess here, finish off the zappies, and now next barrel will, no matter what, put him into lightning range. I'll go for my goblins here, force him to use the ability, then I'll just cannon in the middle here. I'll ice spirit, push the sparky shot over, I'll log it back, and yeah, he raged my king tower. He gave up. Very nice win there. Didn't really give him any chances to win. <laughs> Just avoiding that one prediction at the very start of the game just won for me. Because then after that, he did, like he sacked too much to get only that. I'm in the next match here against Alprin. I'm just going to go for my Princess at the Bridge here. I know that he's playing either Hog EQ or Expo. He goes for the Hog Rider. I'll go for my Mighty Miner Ice Spirit here. Oh, nice. I'm just going to log here, make sure that it doesn't get a hit on my tower. I said nice because I thought the Ice Spirit might get hit by the log. I'll just go for my Barrel here. I'm going to wait for the... Okay, yeah, he goes for Skellies. Now I'll just go for my barrel. He goes for Mighty Miner. Okay, he pops the ability, but he still has to defend the Mighty Miner. I'm going to get my Death Bomb on the tower as well. That's so much damage. <laughs> he just started at the game taking 2300 damage. Couldn't have asked for a better start. I'll just go for my Cannon here. He's going to EQ. I'll just go for my Ice Spirit plus Goblins, and then I can log as well, and I'm taking literally no damage, I think. Yup, he popped, and <laughs> no damage. Let's go. So that's already pretty much good game as long as I play this well. There's no way I choke from this position. I can just rocket every hog rider. Oh, wait, I don't have rocket. I'm stupid. Well, I guess I can just defend every hog rider with a cannon plus ice spirit in the top. Hmm. I guess it could get a little bit tricky if he outcycles me. I'll just barrel here. He goes for the firecracker. He goes for the log now. I'm just going to wait for him to go in and then let's activate my king tower. I'm going to prince his bridge and then I'm going to go cannon, activate the king tower. Go for my ice spirit as well. I'll log on the skeletons, keep my princess alive. Yeah, that firecracker is going to get a shot, but that princess is getting way too much damage, and he just gives up EQs on the king. Let's go. What a nice win there. Already made this guy give up this early with a hard counter. <laughs> I mean, I can't really blame this guy when he's trying to learn the game from Ian. Like, this is what happens when you try to learn how to play from Ian. You just end up getting three crowned by log bait and single elixir. <laughs> Let's go. I'm in the next game here against Cody Go. I'll just go for my cannon here in the middle, counter the wall breakers. So I guess he's playing a minor wall breakers deck. Maybe Mega Knight, but yeah, he's playing minor. I'll go for my goblins here on the minor. 
And I do get one princess shot on the left side, which is super nice. I'll counter the musketeer with my um, mighty miner. Ice spirit wouldn't fully take it out, so I'll just use my mighty miner. I want to save my log as well. He might go for the goblins here. Yeah, he does. I'll just log here, make him do, do something else. He might... Okay, he goes for mighty miner. I'll just go for a cannon on his mighty miner. It's kind of bad, though, because if he poisons my cannon... And then he goes minor wall breakers. I don't have anything for it. Look at my hand. Princess, lightning, goblin, barrel, and ice spirit. I don't have anything at all. Okay, I'm going to have to lightning. I can't risk him pre-logging. I'm going to ice spirit the miner. Yeah, I'm just going to lightning here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> oh my god, that was close. Okay. Mm, nice though. I'll take that. I wonder what his reaction is right now. Just like to having me lightninging on the wall breakers like that. <laughs> That was super close as well. Dude definitely thought he was getting the connection. I'll just go for my goblin barrel here. Force him to use his log. Okay, he's going to goblin since it was the same timing. Oh, princess try to splash the tower. Aw, oh, the unlucky timing. Okay, forced out the mighty miner though. I'll go for my cannon in the middle just to counter the mighty miner. And all of my goblins ready if he wants to go for the miner. I'll go for my mighty miner on his musketeer. He'll have to bomb tire in the middle. Maybe I could just lightning on it, but maybe not as well. No, I won't. We'd be too aggressive. I really want to, but I won't. He's probably just going to go for a wall breaker split or something like that. If I had to guess. I'll just go for my ice spear at the back here. Okay, he goes for minor wall breakers. I'll just log it, and then I'll go for my goblins once his log reaches. Ooh! Okay, nice. That was super close. I'll go for my barrel here, and I'll also pre-lightning. I'll lightning the mighty miner tower and try to hit a goblin. Oh, I still didn't get any damage, except for the lightning. At least I got the lightning damage that hit the Mighty Miner. Oh, Mighty Miner here for his his uh, Miner. Oh, Ice Spirit on the Goblins, and I'll also do my own Goblins on his Mighty Miner. I'll log the Wall Breakers too. He's probably going to do a High Musketeer, because he knows that I have Lightning for the Musketeer, so he doesn't want to give me any value on the Tower. Okay, I was going to Cannon on it, but he did Bomb Tower, so I'll just go for a Princess Far. I'll go for my Barrel, I'll go for my Ice Spirit as well, just to get it back a little bit quicker. Then I have my Goblins ready for the Miner as well. I could have Lightning that if I was very fast. I'm going to log here on the musketeer just to make sure that it gets finished off by the princess. I'll go for my barrel here again. Not back to log yet. Maybe one shot, one shot. Nice. I'll go for my goblins. I'll go for my ice spirit plus log combo to kill the wall breakers. Ice spirit plus log killing wall breakers is, is a saving grace. I'm up by a little bit, but not enough to have the game secured. I'll go for the princess on the musketeer and I'll go for the barrel. Okay, he goes for the log. I'll just ice spirit the back here. I'll goblins on the miner. Oh, I didn't catch it, unfortunately. I'll go for the log here. I'm going to Princess Bridge straight away. Maybe. Nice. That's one shot. Oh, that's two shots because Mighty Miner doesn't heat up fast enough. Okay. I'll go for my Mighty Miner here and then I'll Ice Spirit as well just to make sure that my Mighty Miner kills his. And then I'll just cannon on top of his Musketeer once it locks on. Y'all just cannon here. I'll also pull over the other Mighty Miner. No, it doesn't. I, I don't think I need to defend that. And that's going to kill the Bomb Tower. I'll Barrel here. I could get a Princess down at the bridge. Okay, Princess. Nice. He predicts it. That was nice on him. Oh, wait, th that cannon's going to kill the musk. I'll log it away, and that's going to get a hit on the tower. Okay, perfect. I'll just go for my cannon here. I'll barrel straight away. I just want to keep up the pressure so he can't spam me with minor poisons. Nice. He had nothing for this barrel. He didn't have goblins or log. He's going to try to minor wall breakers me, so I'll, I'll just defend it, and then I'll lightning his tower. Okay, I'll ice spear. Okay, well, that's on the right, so I'll just goblins plus log, and then I'll just lightning on the bomb tower here. You just want to keep my damage lead. I know that in triple elixir, the minor poisons will get a little bit crazy, so I need to start lightninging whenever I can get away with it. Oh, mighty miner here for his mighty miner. Oh, barrel. He's going to minor wall breakers me. Yep, I'm going to log here and I'm going to goblins. Keep everything alive. He goes for another poison. I'll pop my ability. I'll cannon. He's going to keep spamming me with like another musketeer top middle. Yeah, I couldn't lightning that. That was very well placed. Oh, princess here. I'll barrel again. He's going to minor on the princess probably. Yep, I'll go for the log here on the wall breakers. All goblins in the middle just to protect everything. There's only 20 seconds left. Okay, I thought he might give up. I'll lightning the mighty miner here. Very nice value. I'll just ice spirit here and I'll cannon on the musk. I'll go for my goblins. Damn, I didn't catch it. It's fine. All mighty miner here. I know he's going to wall breakers, so I'll just have my log ready. And then I, I know he's going to minor wall breakers again, so I'll ice spirit catch at the back. And then I'll go for my goblins. And yeah, that's game. I'll log as well just to make sure that I win. Very nice win there. That matchup was not as easy as it looked. I know it looked like it, I had a complete hard counter or whatever, but I just played really solid defense and kept like the perfect cycle the whole time. I feel like he made some cycling mistakes too. All right, I'm in the next game here against this guy. He has a tombstone. I'll go for my barrel in the corner here. Probably splash shard. Only really graveyard plays with tombstone. 
I'll just go for my Ice Spear at the bridge here. I'll log on the Tombstone as well. Graveyard's really hard, but I feel like if I play it perfectly, I could win. It's just a little bit rough getting damage. I'll go for my Mighty Miner in the back. Kind of a bad Skelly King from him. I get Princess at the bridge on the right just to apply a bit of pressure and get some quick damage. I'll go for my Princess here. He goes for the Baby Dragon in the back. Perfect timing. Oh, he has Golem. Okay. Golem's easier than Graveyard, but still not, like, amazing. This version of Golem is really, like, it's pretty much like Graveyard. I'll go for my Ice Spear here on the Baby Dragon, and then I can go for Ice Spear to pull it into the range of both towers. Very nice Ice Spear there. I'll go for my Barrel on the left side. Of course, I'm the Barb Barrel. I'll just log on the Tombstone here so I can Princess at the Bridge again. <laughs> just want to keep the Tombstone off the board, because Princess at the Bridge threat is very strong. Okay, I'm going to Princess Bridge if he doesn't do anything. Okay, I'll leak for a second. I'll do it now. Bro, what was that timing? I was even about to put it on the other side, too. That sucks. Okay, I'll goblins here for the baby dragon. It still gets one hit on my tower, but it's fine. I'd rather just put it at the bridge and do a barrel. I don't. He doesn't have barb barrel. And then, yeah, he goes for night witch and nato. Hopefully that doesn't activate. Oh, that was a good king tower activation by him. I'll go for my mighty miner, and then I'll go for my princess on the night witch. I'll just log here, make sure that my Mighty Miner kills this Skeleton King. Oh, Ice Spirit on the Night Witch as well. Just make sure it doesn't get any damage on my tower. I want to be, like, really conservative with my health in the beginning just because the the Lightning damage kind of stacks up when they go Golem Lightning over and over again. And on top of that, he's always going to get, like, a tiny bit of chip with the Golemite, so I need to save some damage. I'll go for my Princess here on the Baby Dragon. Try not to take any hits, hopefully. One at the most. He could get a Lightning here off. I'll go for my Mighty Miner in the back. He's definitely going to Lightning both of these, but I'll go for my Ice Spirit Barrel. I'll try to outcycle him and get some of the damage back. He goes for the Night Witch. He's just going to let that go. Yeah, I didn't think he'd commit again. I could have Lightninged on that. I feel like I should have. I'll go for my Princess here for the Night Witch, and I'll go for my Log on the ability. The reason I think I should have is because I can't punish him for doing that anyway, since he's just going to use a, a spell on my Barrel anyway. And then he'll have his other spell for my next barrel, so I'm not going to get any damage at all. I'll Princess in the back again, and then I'll... I'm not going to log on the Tombstone this time. I don't need to. I'll just Goblins here, and I'll barrel again. Okay, he goes for the Skelly King. Okay, he... Yeah, he Tornadoes that. I'm going to try to keep my Princesses alive. I'm going to pop the ability here. I'll Ice Spirit as well. Please block it, block it, block it. Nice. Okay, I'll log here on the left, and then I'll go for my Princess here. I have three Princesses down. <laughs> Please die, 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 die. No, it killed one. That's stupid. Okay, I'll just barrel here. He bar barrels. I'll go for my goblins on it, and then I'll lightning that as well. I don't, I don't want to make the same mistake of not taking my my value when I can get it. He goes for the baby dragon in the back. I can't protect this because it's not going to walk into tower range. I'll just ice spirit the back and I'll princess. This should counter the baby dragon for only one hit at the most. Almighty miner for his skeleton king. I'll, I'll let that baby dragon shoot. I can't do anything about it. I'm up 900 HP. I'll go for my cannon in the middle here. I don't want to put it uh, too high. I'll pop the ability here because I need the Mighty Miner for his Golem anyway. I'll log here, keep my Princess up. I'll go for my Barrel. I'll go for a second Princess. I'll go for Ice Spirit to keep it in range of the Mighty Miner. I don't, I don't want it to walk out. Okay, now the Golem's about to die. I'll go for my Goblins here on the Night Witch, and I'll go for my Barrel. Mm, I'll go for my Princess again. I'll go for the Log, finish it off. I'll Ice Spirit too. Okay, I have two Princesses going in to defend this Golem. This is nice. I'll pre-cycle a cannon. He's going to get a lightning off on all three of them, but at least he's knocking in my tower. I'll Princess Bridge as well to get some chip damage. Okay, nice. And the barrel hit. I'll go for my, my Mighty Miner here on the Golem. I'll go for Ice Spirit. This is going to get really, really scary. Um, Just because he has the three-card cycle, so he's going to put another Golem down. Yep, he Golems again. All Goblins in the back. I'll Princess. I'll go for another Log. I'll go for a cannon here just to block, force him to lightning, and then I'm just going to get back to another... Lightning. I mean, not lightning. Cannon. I'll cannon again. I'll go for Ice Spear on the Barb Barrel. I'll go for another Barrel. Okay, I'll go for the my Goblins here. Nice, my Barrel's on Tower. I'll log this. I'll cannon pull up the Golemites. Okay, I'll go for the High Mighty Miner. I'll Ice Spirit here. I'll go for my Goblins. And then I can log too. I didn't even need that log, but I don't need to Lightning it back, so it doesn't matter. I'll Lightning now. It won't even reach, but that's game. Very nice win there. And that's going to be top one. Thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.